Hello friend. Hey, I don't know. Today I have the project for GSM alarm uh, vibrator when your car has stolen. The somebody open your car and try to stole your car. When you put the sensor, we call vibrator sensor and send the signal to G. Uh, I don't know and I don't know send to G S M 900 then send the message to you like this this is the vibrator sensor send the signal to pin number 9 and when this activate will send the G S M module will send the alarm or the message to your cell phone it is the message why a warning car vibrator too high so what the high work I try to check my car I hope it works work now you has a vibration is one so now you get another message see how you get the alarm see So this is the combination between sensor, LCD, and <coughs> GM module. So how how the program how the program work? The original program I uh, use from a friend in YouTube his name uh, Aida Yu Sabri my boutique so and I had a little bit uh, modification this program so I start by include the LCD I square C this is liquid crystal I square C it is the for the L C D and the next one is for uh, this one for the GM I use the serial serial software I connect uh the TX from GSM to number two TX so GSM TX GSM TX uh, 2 2 2 uh, X 2 number 3 that's it. Okay. The I put the vibrator sensor in number nine, pin number nine, and vibrator uh, parameter. This one for receive the the state of the pin number nine. So my serial. For GPS is nice six zero zero. I st the next is I start LCD initial and backlight. Don't forget. Then we tell. Pin, uh, we use 
pin mode to assign the vibrator sensor to be input. Serial. Then we start. Let this serial monitor pin this word wording. Pin this word out. Uh, what else? No. We have more than that. So this one. Okay, that's the that's setup. The next is while loop. The while loop is start by vibrator status equal return read vibrator sensor. I read the sensor status by use this command. Data read uh, save the status here, and then print zero pin let pin status out and this is a via the value from vibrator status. What you see, you will, you will have uh, this one. So this one is vibrator and the status. So and then you clear the screen, LCD screen, and you got flash. Let it clear and set the zero. You pin vibrator at the forms address zero address zero start at the beginning and row zero at the first row and uh, the next you print at the address zero and low number one low number one and you what you print you print the value of this vibrator status you see value so you leave five milliseconds, five hundred, uh, five hundred milliseconds. So that if the next is if the check the condition if the vibrator status is high, it's high mean when you check your car. Check 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 check. Yes, that's it. You're gonna get. Number one. Okay. I hope this works. Yes. And then we had another. We have another. Uh, we have another message for the net for this time now. Uh, for the Yes, 40. 440. 440. This is how you get the message. So, this is uh, AT command. The ATCMGF equal 1. You set the JM module in tech mode. Delay one second and uh, you set this is your phone, watch phone number you want to send. So, and, uh, what you want to send, you send uh, this is one car vibrator. This is a little bit not complicated. This is serial, and then this one you want control set. To stop that take. This is a clear LCD. Okay, this that's all. Not to complicate it into my. Thank you, my friend from uh you know, from YouTube. My uh Sabri, my body I got idea from him. <coughs> so this is one to. Uh, do the project. This look complicated, but when we take some of that and a little bit modification, that you can have the good project. Okay, thank you for watching. Uh, see you next clip video and subscribe and share for support my video. Thank you for watching.